Hello everyone, welcome to Vicar David's 60 second slot. The Gospels give the impression that life could sometimes get very hectic and busy in Jesus' day. But consider how much more busy they are in our own times with the constant uh, demands of different media which surround us all the time. Well, mindfulness uh, training can teach us quite a lot about how to deal with different stresses and uh, demands on our time. Uh, and lifestyle. And one way of doing this is by breathing and doing breathing exercises. Did you know that we breathe between 15 and 25 times every minute? So uh, that is uh, in a day between 21,000 and 36,000 times. But by controlling how breathing, we can also we can have an effect on how uh, calm uh, we are and how we feel and how uh, we can be filled with, with oxygen and filled with breath, which can calm us down. One way of doing this is by different animal breaths. So here's a few to share with you, a few exercises which you can do and which can help us to uh, become calm and also can help us then uh, to feel uh, more relaxed in our busy uh, lifestyle. So here's one. This is bunny breath. You can triple the amount of breaths that you do uh, in a minute by taking breathing like a bunny. This is three short breaths through the nose and then one long breath. Exhale. So it's that's bunny breath. Another one is burr breath. So burrs only uh, breathe six times every minute and in hibernation once every 45 seconds. So what we could do then is breathe in, counting six, hold it for six and breathe out for six. That's And do that a few times and it has a remarkably calming uh, effect on us. And the last one is snake breath. And that's just very simple. That's to breathe in slowly through the nose and breathe out through the mouth, making a hissing sound. So that's. Any one of those animal exercises can help us uh, be still and be calm and be more in control of ourselves. There's many more, actually, uh, you can find on YouTube, different animal breaths, breathing exercises. One of the descriptions in the Bible of the Holy Spirit is of the breath of God, literally uh, a wind uh, traveling uh, through us that we can feel and we can breathe in ourselves. The, the word that's given to it is ruah, ruah, which literally means the breath of God. And the gospels invite us to breathe that breath of God into ourselves as we uh, experience and are filled, literally filled uh, physically with that breath and filled with the power of the Holy Spirit. And rather than do that in a kind of uh, uncontrolled way, if we have some uh, an exercise where we control that, I think that we can have the power of that spirit in us at work, uh, calming us, making us more in control, making us feel better about ourselves. In a word, mindfulness and wellfulness. Thank you for watching and God bless you.